All right, hello everyone. Happy Saturday. Here we have a whole pile of Airedale Terrier puppies. These are Mia and Caesar's Airedale Terrier puppies. They were born May 16th, 2024. They are about three and a half weeks old and today is Saturday, June 8th. Here are the three girls. They're scooching off the rug. Come on back. Come on back, ladies. These are the three girls. They are all spoken for. Here we go. Here we go. Here's the three girls. Here's the one, two, three. And next weekend, I will put different color collars on them so you can start telling them apart. Um, I do that at four weeks. And then at the five and a half week mark, um, I do a video describing all the differences I'm seeing in personalities and looks. And then at six weeks, I get it. And that's a really long video. And then at six weeks, I get another really long video. Um, so you get an extra video from your weekly ones in there. And then we start puppy picking in the order I receive deposits. So we do still have a whole pile of males left. Um, I think two, I should have looked. Can't remember. I feel like just one of them is spoken for, maybe two. <laughs> I'm mixing them up. But there's still a whole bunch of Airedale males left. Um, so if you are interested, there's still a chance to get to pick out of eight males, um, at least third pick out of the eight. I'm thinking that it's second pick. The ad is updated on our website. Sorry that I'm forgetting right now. Um, but yeah, so there's eight males in this litter and there's still plenty left. So you get to pick from a lot of puppies, which is a great opportunity. That's something this guy is out. That's something people are always asking me. And, and kind of coveting is to be able to have, you know, to be able to pick out of a large number of puppies and find that perfect puppy for you. So don't miss out on that chance. They are doing excellent. Oh, you're a vocal one, aren't you? Aren't you? Yeah, that's why I put collars on next weekend so you can kind of start telling them apart, see if anybody catches your eye. But they're three and a half weeks, so... Three and a half, four and a half weeks is kind of a time when developmentally um, the puppies are learning to be like what it's like to be away from mom. They're, they're acknowledging, oh, I'm not with my mom and oh, I'm within some new environment and, you know, oh, I'm away from my siblings. All those things the human babies kind of go through a similar thing where they all of a sudden start recognizing strangers and that's kind of the phase that the puppies are in right now. Um, so this is an age that we don't want to scare them to death or anything, but we really try hard to expose them to different people, different like surfaces to walk on, different smells, sounds. Um, cause this is the age that they're kind of figuring out, okay, this isn't scary. I'm okay. I'm safe and all that. So that's something we really work hard at at this age. So again, those are the two females laying there and this is the third female. Um, so you'll see a little bit more of that next weekend. Sometimes that can kind of look look like fear in puppies because again, they're learning. And um, so that's you can kind of expect that to come. And then usually the reason I start doing puppy descriptions at five and a half weeks is because around then is when we're kind of out of, the, we're out of that phase. By five weeks, typically we're out of that phase. Um, but we're before the next phase, which is just crazy terrier puppy energy where they're running around so wild. It's hard to even, especially with this many puppies, it's hard to even be able to like identify one from another. So that's why we pick when we do. Um, we feel like it's the perfect time to pick puppies and we walk you through it. And um, if you have any questions about that or the process, always feel free to reach out. But they are all doing really good. <laughs> and they're growing fast. And they're just so stinking healthy. And mom is doing such a fabulous job with 11 puppies. Seriously. So here they are. They are doing wonderful. And I hope you all have a wonderful weekend.